are sitting courtside at the stunning Scarborough Beach in Western Australia for the women's final of round seven of the Renault National Beach Volleyball Series. The weather has been outstanding and all the players have had a fantastic tournament. On centre court for the women's final, we have Australia's number one team, Bakara Palmer and Louise Borden, up against Justine and Jordan Moen. Kerry, what are the Moen sisters going to have to do to win this match? Well, John, they've really got their work cut out for them. They're up against a professional beach volleyball team. Justine and Jordan, they train around their uni, around their work. So, look, they just don't get the hours that Beck and Lou do, but they've got nothing to lose. They should just go for it. Absolutely. 6-4 in the first set for Bakara and Louise. They have got the hats on, the Moen sisters. Nearest to camera, we're going to see an opportunity for Bakara to crush one away. Oh, and didn't she crush it away? Justine's block, just too wide on the line. This time Jordan Moen going for a side out, picked up by Bakara quite easily. Bakara wrong footing Jordan in the backcourt, made it look like she was going down the line, but just flipping it to the left. 12-6 now, the score, Bakara Palmer from South Australia really spanking the jump serve. Jordan and Justine just can't find a way to find the sand unless they go over on one. That's right, Jordan put herself in a really good spot there. She was inside the court. She just had to use her reflexes to get that one back. 17-11 now, the number one seed's leading comfortably in the first set. This is Bakara and Lou's opportunity to extend the lead. Bakara shut down. Justine rejects. That's what we've seen from Justine all tournament and in the semi. That's what got them into this final. But our number one seeds, Borden and Palmer, looking to take out the first set. But no, Justine doesn't want to finish just now. One set point saved. Four remain. Justine's got to do something special to close this gap. Oh, Lou and Beck, they go for the second ball play. They win the first set. See here on the Renault replay, the lefty just crushing it into the block. Wins the first set. We get underway with the second set of the women's final now. A little bit scrappy to start with. Oh, that's not scrappy. Lou Borden, she's so focused. She's such a strong player. No chance for Justine to block that out. 3-1 the score now. Bakara and Lou nearest the camera. This is Lou Borden. Oh, it's hammered that at Jordan Moen, but she's got it back. What a great defensive up. I'll get another chance to convert. Second time's a charm. What a beautiful cut shot. Bakara Palmer to the left. Lou Borden with a flat float serve. Jordan picked up easily by Palmer again in defence. Off the block, down the line. What a swing. Yeah, you'll see just too much court savvy on behalf of their number one seeds. They can put that ball anywhere. So it's Bakara again on serve reception again. The roll shot, though, Jordan reacted better this time. She's going to roll it herself. The block's pretty good. What can Justine do? Can she hit a winner? Oh, just. That's a nice one. Nice little tip. Save the day. Here we have Bakara again. The score 19 10 in their favour. Good pick up, Jordo. One arm. Second ball crunch. Oh, you just love the lefty winding up on that second ball. That'll bring up the championship point 2010. What a way to finish for our number one seeds. You ladies are the champions. We were so happy just with the way that we played, not just with the result, but also just playing really strong and putting our game out there, but bringing a lot of variation and pumping some aces. That's our game, and so we're happy with today. As the sun sets over Scarborough Beach here on WA, no real surprises. Australia's number one men's and women's team taking home the gold medal. What an amazing weekend. We'll see you next time.